Hello everyone, I'm Ed Veer, and welcome to my little corner of the world where we try to make things just a little bit better. Uh, right now, I thought I'd take a nice little moment to go relaxing and hit this fishing spot that everybody's been talking about lately. And just see how a little relaxing day in the sun, fishing and doing my enjoyable thing. Well, eh, we can look at it now. Uh, it doesn't look like the fishing hole I thought it would be, obviously. Uh, okay, let's see if we can get on in. I had to sneak into the horde area, so, you know, that's for those of you who like a little bit of fun. Oh, gosh, look at that. We've got to fight the crowds to get here, though. It's a popular place, apparently. So we're going to try and get find us a nice... Uh, yeah, okay. This looks like a great fishing hole, doesn't it? Swampy. Oil barrels in the water. Ah, it looks like my perfect place. Uh, it's not exactly what I was promised. Well, let's set it up and see what we got here anyway. So let me take my handy dandy trusty fishing chair out. All right. Looky there. I'm set and ready to fish. Put my hat on. Looky there. We're already fishing. All right. There's looks like another fisherman there. I don't see too many people fishing here. Uh, I can see why we got the place to ourselves now. And there's a raw long jaw mud snapper. All right. Oh, there's another fun. Okay. Uh, in all seriousness, so we are here. At the sludge fan and lately I've been seeing a lot of videos coming here and fishing for the broken wine bottle now on my realm it is currently selling for 300,000 gold that's US Illyria however there are currently six of them up there on auction one of them is mine so all of a sudden the competition is fierce but what prompted this was Seeing a lot of videos pop up lately on fishing for this broken wine bottle as a transmog item. It's a white item. And of course, it's like all transmogs, the sell rate is slow. But, you know, I heard videos, people are saying 30 minutes. You can catch it in about 30 minutes or so. I'm thinking, if you catch it that fast, then... You know, uh, people would be out here fishing, fishing it up all the time and whooshing it out there and putting it on the auction house. It wouldn't be, you know, three, I think one video I saw it was on the European realm, showed it selling for 250000 Another video was about 200000 somewhere around there parts, you know, and everybody's saying, oh, we just quick, easy catch. So I went ahead and uh, ran the numbers. I used Fishing Buddy to count my casts and my catches and all that stuff. So what we have, as far as our numbers go, out of 487 casts, I caught one broken wine bottle. So that's a rate of 0.2%. As you can see right there. I hope you can see it. If not, let me know and I can do it better for you. So you got a 0.2% drop rate for this. Not great. It's at 488 casts now. I've done three while making this video. The biggest by far is you got your long jaw mud snapper. I'm catching that 33% of the time. Old Wagon Wheel is actually a transmog shield, but you catch so many of them, it's not worth going after. 15% of the time I've been catching those. Brilliant Small Fish, 12.3%. Briscoe Whisker Catfish. Now those, is a great place if you're working on your 
cooking recipes, you can get some ingredients for to cook the fish for some of the cooking recipes. You get some sage fish, 4.7% of the time. Uh, what I found interesting was you can get some coarse blasting powder up. Uh, one about one percent of the time watertight trunks you can get some transmog green items out of there as well as various other things 0.8 percent of the time uh, you get oil covered fish nine percent nine point four percent of the time now those i've actually been selling you know it's like two to nine gold on the auction house but they have actually sold now and then so it's not not worth looking over like I said, broken wine bottle for two point a uh, point two percent chance so far for your and the rest of it's just pretty much junk. But there's also supposed to be you're supposed to be able to catch the twenty two pound catfish now. As you can see, out of four hundred eighty nine casts, almost five hundred. I haven't caught one of those yet, so I have no data to tell you on that. Obviously, it's a little bit rarer than the broken wine bottle uh it takes unfortunately with you if you uh, alliance it takes you some doing to get here uh it took me roughly 10 minutes to get here but i took the portal to aldham then flew from aldham to south baron hold to honors hold i'm sorry honor stand in the southern barons and then flew my flew across from there to here so about 10 minutes the other route would be to fly to ratchet depending on which way you go you could almost do it that way go go through uh, stranglethorn and take the ship across to ratchet and fly from ratchet to here but you'd have to do it there's no alliance flight pass nearby on a horde character it's nice because you can just fly out of Orgrimmar and pretty much just out the back door and fly straight here. Um, other than that, the other bonus in this place though is, and I have not tested it since Dragonflight came out, but this used to be a good area for transmog. Just kill these venture company drudgers now before dragonflight i i was gathering data on this area and i was coming out here with quite a bit of gold or val well, i should say take that back value gold value and items i was hitting four or five million every for an hour run in item value a lot of that did not sell so i was not able to convert it to real value now i don't see the same results the market's changed and i would need to go back but i would not say this would be a four to five million gold per hour farm i have gotten a couple items out of here while i've been fishing for you know i think i sold i sold one green transmog item for 1100 gold so it's it's not as good as it was but I don't think it's as bad as as bad as anything either. I just hadn't tested it to give you the exact results. So if you if you get tired of fishing, like I said, pretty much almost 500 casts, one broken wine bottle. You know, uh, you can turn around and start uh, killing these guys off. Go back to fishing you know do a couple laps around the pond and fish a little bit and you can see old wagon wheel I've got three times two twice in a row so that is and it is this shield right here that's the old wagon wheel it's seven gold on there and it's dropping minimum buyout seven gold uh, you see, I've got four in my bags, just some sitting here fishing. I picked up four all this time. There's the oil-covered fish. It's currently, it looks like minimum buyout is, or market value is currently set to 17 gold. But it does sell. That's not going to sell fast, but I do sell out of that when I put it on there. 
uh, and that's it in a nutshell. You're going after the broken wine bottle, the sludge fins. Uh, for those of you that need it, coordinates, I'm sitting at 57.99 and 20.42. It's up there at the top of my screen, just above the mini map. So we should be in good shape there. As you can see, even the area location so bad, even my chair deserted me. So if you found this video interesting or helpful in any way, please drop a like and subscribe to my channel. Leave a, and leave a comment, you know. Uh, don't tell me you don't like point and click because that's the way I play. Uh, I'm not looking to change the way I, the style I play or how I play, but you know, leave some comments about what you'd like to see, uh, what you'd like to have me do, or, you know, even if you want to challenge me to do something, we can see if I can do that. Thank you all, and have a great day, and may you find everything you're looking for.